Good morning children. Now we shall learn about the perimeter of a figure. So, what is a perimeter? Let us understand it first. This is Mehnat Ram. His doctor asked him to at least walk 1 kilometer every day because morning walk is good for health. So, instead of walking on the sides of the road, he decided to walk along the garden to get fresh air. Now, can you tell how much distance he walked when he took one round of this garden? One round means he travelled a total distance of this much which is shown by the red dotted lines. Now, suppose we know the lengths of the sides of this garden, then how much distance did Maharatram travel? He travelled starting from A to B, he covered a distance of 50 meters. Then from B to C, he covered again a distance of 50 meter. Next, from C to D, he covered again 50 meters and again he covered 50 meters and he is back to where he started which means he completed one round of the garden. So, how much distance did he cover? That is 50 meter plus 50 meter plus 50 meter plus 50 meter. So, what is perimeter here? You can say the total distance around a figure is called the perimeter of that figure. So, 50 meter plus 50 meter plus 50 meter plus 50 meter is the perimeter of this garden. And this was what? This was the boundary of this figure or it was the total distance along the shape of the figure. Now you already know about line segments. So let's use the length of line segments to find the perimeter. So what would be the perimeter? It would be the length of line segment AB which is 50 meter then the length of line segment BC which is 50 meter next the length of line segment CD which is again 50 meters and lastly the length of line segment AD which is 50 meters so we can say the perimeter of a closed figure is the sum of the lengths of its line segments correct and here it is equal to 200 meters see this is the perimeter now how many rounds should Mehnatram take in order to complete one kilometer in one round he completed 200 meters and he has to complete one kilometer so how can he do it we know one kilometer is equal to thousand meters so if we divide thousand by two hundred we will get the number of rounds so thousand divided by two hundred is equal to five so Mehnatram needs to take five rounds of this garden or you can say he has to cover the perimeter of this garden five times in order to cover a distance of one kilometer. So now you know what is the perimeter of a given figure. It is the total distance around a figure. So in the case of square field it would be shown by this red dotted line. You can also say that it is the sum of the line segments that make up that close figure. Again here in the case of rectangular field it would be shown by this 
red dotted lines so it is equal to the boundary of a given figure understood bye bye children